the Druitz 1759 Maiden Stakes is next. It's two mile five. This is pretty much as long as you go on the flat. I think it's a two mile six at Royal Ascot, but it's Alamo Reaver for James Shea, Archduke for Craig Beckwith, David Cordell for Martin Leedham, Flower Seller for Satyam, Illustrated Craig Beckwith, Minister of Justice Paul Rose, Dyer Shara's sister, Graham Clitterbrook, Infinite Prospect, David Robertson, Made Fantastic, Thomas Rogers, Maiden Brumaire for David Robertson, and Vinnie Gerard's got the bottom two. They're both San Jose's, one's about and one's water, and away they go. And it's Maiden, Maiden Brumaire who's the first out with Flower Seller right over on that far side. And uh, Flower Seller looks like it wants the lead, but there's a long way to go yet, and you don't want to burn up too much energy racing to get the lead. But I think it's a Satyam, so it's probably going to want to be in the lead. So, Minister of Justice is back in second, then David Cordell third, and Alamo River receiver fourth. Then comes Arch Duke after that one, looking towards the back. Maiden Brumaire was quickly out, he's now the back marker, but Flower Seller has gone on then and leads by a good five lengths. And we'll do well to keep this up throughout the race. David Cordell's moved through in a second, Minister of Justice is third, then comes Alamo River with Dyer Shana's sister and Arch Duke after that one. And they're going quite a strong pace for a two mile five furlong race. And Flower Seller. Is the one setting it and could be pulling a few of these along a little bit faster than they want to go, I would think. And Flower Center is then who's going to pass the stands with a complete circuit of the track to go shortly. They'll pass the winning post and then they'll swing out left handed. It's a big track, this. And Flower Cellar. Passes the winning post for the first time in the lead, with David Coverdale just about showing second on the outside of Minister of Justice. Then comes Alamo Reaver between the two, with Dyer Shara's sister behind that one. And then on the inside, Arch Duke with the white sleeves and the blue body. And the two in the green, the two Vinnie Gerard, San Jose about and San Jose Water. Then made fantastic and illustrated with Infinite Prospect and Maiden Brumaire, the two David Rolston horses bringing up the rear. So Flower Seller it is then, good six lengths clear of the chasing pack who are headed by Minister of Justice, Alamo Reaver, and then David Cover has now dropped back in a fourth, Dyer Shana's sister on the inside is fifth, then comes Arch Duke, the San Jose's are getting a little bit closer, and made fantastic after that and illustrated with Infinite Prospect and Maiden Brumaire still the back two. Flower Seller's lead is down to a little more than three and a half now. With Minister of Justice second, Alamo Reaver third, David Coverdale fourth, and Dyer Shana's sister fifth. That all has been pretty much the same throughout. Then comes San Jose Water with Arch Duke on the inside of San Jose about. Then comes Illustrated and Made Fantastic and Maiden Brewer and Infinite Prospect still the back two. Nine furlongs left to race now then. And Flower Seller has not really seen another horse yet. But the lead is only a couple of lengths now. Minister of Justice is poised in the second. In comes Alamo Reaver and Dea Shana sister San Jose Water has made significant progress and gone past David Coverdale. Then comes Archduke. With Illustrated just having dropped to the back. Also made fantastic, has lost its place a little bit as well, but Flower Seller continues to lead by two. To San Jose Water has moved through in a second now, Minister of Justice still there on the inside in third. Alamo Reaver being pushed along in fourth, then Dyer Shana's sister. Then after that, David Cordon making a good looking move around the outside, Infinite Prospect and Stable Companion Maiden Brumaire is sort of following that move, albeit on the inside. But it's Flower Seller now being pushed along past the five pole from San Jose Waters, a clear second, and looks like he's going to be the one to challenge for the lead. Minister of Justice is still there in third, Infinite Prospect looks to be going one on the outside, fourth, Dyer sister, and Alamo Reaver under pressure. David Cornell's dropping right out the back, but it's Flower Seller in the lead. From San Jose Water in second, gap back to Minister of Justice in third. Coming around the outside, San Jose about now coming through to join this leading pair, and so too is illustrated as the complexion of the race changes inside the final three furlong. Flower Seller being pushed along in front, San Jose Water illustrated. San Jose about Diashana system, Minister of Justice running on again, and Flower Seller finally surrenders the lead of a two furlong pole to San Jose Water, but that one is immediately pressed by Illustrated. Illustrated is trying to go on. Here comes Diashana system. 
Jonathan bursting off the centre and it's Dyer showing a sister San Jose about San Jose Water. Dyer showing a sister into the final furlong. Dyer showing a sister by half a length in to San Jose about San Jose Water. In front of Prospect is running on but Dyer showing a sister is strong in front and Dyer showing a sister is beginning to pull away. Dyer showing a sister takes it from San Jose about San Jose Water and in front of Prospect and Archduke and a miniature of justice and all the way back to David Cordell who was last. Graham Clutterbuck thinks he's got some good stairs this season. And I think he's just showing up there. Dyeshana Sister, a comfortable winner. Really, even though it was only three quarters of a length, Dyeshana Sister wins it for Graham Clutterbuck. Vinnie Gerard second and third. San Jose about and San Jose Water. Infinite prospect for David Robertson was fourth. And Archduke for Craig Beckwith was fifth. <laughs>